Hi, I'm Dr. Julie Steinauer and today I'd like to talk to you a little bit more about strabismus. Strabismus is an eye turn and for our purposes we'll talk about the three main types. Um, we have an inward eye turn called an esotropia, an outward eye turn called an exotropia, and an upward eye turn called a hypertropia. You can also have a downward eye turn, but we'll kind of shy away from that one a little bit today. I have some glasses on my table here, and um, what these are representing are, these are the glasses that we utilize in therapy for strabismic patients, and this is light therapy or syntonic phototherapy. Um, what we do with the glasses is that we have our patients wear them. Be depending upon what their diagnosis is, they might wear a different type of glasses. But they'll wear the glasses a couple minutes a day, a couple times per week, and it is a trigger to the brain to turn on something with the muscle of the eye. So everyone always thinks that strabismus is caused by a weak muscle. Wrong, okay? It's not a weak muscle. It's actually the control of the brain and the process of how it controls the muscle that's the problem. It's not a weak muscle. So when we talk about eye surgery, we think about trying to chop a muscle or lengthen a muscle, and we have to think about this differently. It's the brain that controls the muscle. So what we're trying to do is turn the brain on through the process of light therapy with these different goggles to control the problem muscle. So if the eye is turning in, we have a pair of glasses to help the eye turn back out. If the eye is turning out, we have a pair of glasses that signals the brain and muscle to turn the eye back in. Same thing with the eye going up, we have one that pulls the eye back down. It's awesome, it's exciting, it's probably the thing that I love the most about my practice. Visit us at visionforlifeworks.com to learn more. Thank you.